Hey, what's up everyone? Hang on, I'm from the land of Down Under. I should be saying good day, mates. Welcome to Overland Journals. My name is Duncan and in today's video, I'm gonna share with you something really stupid I did. See you after the showreel. Welcome back everyone. Um, I'm always preaching about how it is important to do trip pre-planning. And it is important, I'm not denying, um, whether checking your vehicle or, or the, the route itself, pre-planning a trip is very, very important. But sometimes I, uh, the stupidity in me comes out and I overlook certain things, like what happened recently during our Flinders Rangers trip. Uh, something I didn't check and that got me into trouble. So first go check this out and then come back. So I want to share with you a mistake I made. Um, I should have known better, but it just happened. Um, I've got two awnings mounted on the 4B, one on either side. And the whole idea behind it is during, depending on weather, uh, especially if it is raining or too sunny, um, I open both out and I'll have the swag underneath one of them and the other side for sitting and cooking and you know, that sort of thing. What happened yesterday, that was the idea of the setup I was about to do when the rain came down. But then I discovered that one of the awnings was not working. The poles that hold the awning out wasn't working. I have no idea why or what it is. I just didn't have the time to look into why it's not working, but it just didn't work. So I should have known better before, uh, during my trip planning stage, I should have opened everything up and checked I didn't. So. I'm sharing this with you. If you're planning a trip and you're trying to get out there, just double check on certain things and make sure they're functioning properly. Uh, so this is a lesson I learned the hard way because then I had to cram everything under one uh, awning, which is not possible because what I have is a two meter by three meter awning and to put in the swag underneath and the cooking and everything else in there was just quite not nice. So yeah, here's a little tip and a lesson from mistakes I've made. So there you uh, go, a simple mistake. I should have followed through on my pre-planning checklist, which I didn't for whatever reason, and that got me in trouble. Even though the cameras were not running at that time, it was pouring cats and dogs, and it was quite a mission or a nightmare to try and you know get ourselves dry under you know under cover. One awning came out that was easy as yes, the second one was just a disaster. Uh, I'm even surprised that we're still married. My wife was pissed. So the moral of this video is do those important checks before you go on a trip, because once you're out there and things go wrong, it's too late, uh, and you don't want that to you know uh, put a damp on you know the, the good times you're having. So learn from my mistakes. So hope you liked that video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. If you haven't subscribed already, please do subscribe. My channel is all about sharing my overlanding experiences, both good and bad, with the wider community and also learning from you guys. So give it a thumbs up, guys, and I'll see you next week in another video. Thanks for watching.